You know, Chico, hold up. Where do you think you're going, man? You gotta hold up Johnny, to him. I'm talking to you, all right? Back off of him, you stupid shit. Can't you tell the difference between a knock and one of my upstanding business associates? I'm sorry about Andreas here. It's impossible to find good help in this city. I'm supposed Don't to worry about it. Hey, yo. Uh, what up, Johnny boy? boy? What up? Talk to your girl. Let's make it happen, Captain. I didn't think you lost bikers got down with peoples like Mark here. Then with their sports bike, you with your choppers. <laughs> and looking at the two of you, it don't make no sense to me. It's a crazy city. Well, this is crazy times, Liz. And there's a recession going on. And in this troubling economic climate, you gotta make compromises. Malk here is my compromise. Hey, yo, fuck you, clown. <laughs> you can compromise these nuts. Shit. Give me some. These ain't probably <laughs> dimes for us. Yeah. People always gonna want what we got to sell. Yeah. Uh, they gonna want even more products when they lose their jobs and ain't got nothing else. Okay, I guess all we gotta worry about is the cops taking us down there. True that, cat. Hey, yo, E, let them know what it is. You gotta take some thieving, snitching motherfuckers and show them I'm a bitch. But I ain't they fucking bitch, okay? They bribed the guard on the Eastboro Bridge to let them through without checking their loan, right? You guys is gonna go down there and tear them apart. Entiende? Uh, it is. Now get the fuck out of here! We out! Right, we out. Okay, ma. Avanza, cabrones. Hey, let's, let's go. go. Bus. Yeah, fucking parade. Una criada, Andreas! Watch your mouth, son. Make fuck yourself you. useful and clean this shit up! Okay, okay, but you know what? I'm gonna need some wrong gloves. I'm gonna be honest, okay? I think we better take a cage on this run. Can you get your people to bring our bikes to the drop-off? They teach you boys how to play with the big dogs in the Lost MC? I hope so, because this bitch bike back. Lead the way, Johnny. What was all this shit with you dissing me in front of Elizabeth, man? I thought you could handle it. I can't handle motherfucker. She's just one cold female, and I don't want her thinking I'm a bitch. Then I guess you got to prove yourself. No pressure, man. Go fuck yourself, Johnny. This is one serious gun, amigo. This what they call a street sweeper? That's about accurate for this shit. It'll carve through any motherfuckers dumb enough to stand down wind of us. No doubt. I'm guessing Liz wants this convoy head like a fucking freight train if this is the firepower she's dishing out. Should be interesting. So great. I'm gonna take care of this. We're gonna get through this. Yeah, it's okay. You What's just the problem? You're holding traffic up. What's the hey, problem? Hey, we're kind of in a rush here, okay? Honey, Listen to me, right. man. You gotta get out of the way. You're holding up traffic. What's the problem here? Okay. Hey, would you just let us through? Look, you don't gotta exact change. You're not going through. Those are the rules. I don't make them, but I stick to them. So just turn around well, and head back to the I'll come you? back with all the exact change that you need. All right? Just let us you through, please. You gonna pay my bills and put food on the table? Hey, turn around hey, now. Look, I got some change right here. Come on, let's get this shit moving. All right, this was on us. Now move your ass. Thanks, guys. You're doing great, honey. It's okay. Just... All right, now. Let's do this. Good thing that little family didn't come through here five minutes later. This is Clay's phone. Leave your details. The shipment's the target. Yeah, yeah, you're good to go. You're good. Go, go. But this looks like one of those uh, fake bills I've been hearing about. You know how it is. Can't trust nothing nowadays. Can't trust the price of gas. Can't trust this president for sure. And you know you can't even trust this money. 
Enough of this shit. Just let me through, okay? Alright, go ahead, go ahead. Let's go. You might just get me Fans ours now! We gotta lock up on the point, man. Come on. Don't make me come after you. So Malcolm, I got a question for you. Sure thing, Jonathan. Shoot. Well, Malcolm, it's your crew. The Uptown Riders. Are you uh, a motorcycle club like us? The Angels of Death? I don't know. I mean, we ride bikes and we ride them hard, but the thing is, we don't wear fancy dresses or do pinky finger shakes or anything like that, so I ain't sure what that makes us. We're adults here, Malcolm. Allegedly, Johnny Boy. Allegedly. So let's not let this descend into an argument about the merits of good American machinery versus foreign plastic fantastic crap. Or why you guys look like rejects from a bondage club. Or why you guys dress like the Republican Space Rangers. Ouch! Anyway, what I'm asking is, what's the deal with this music you put out, the branded clothing and shit? Just part of our vibe, man. Roll with it. The vibe? Yeah, man. The vibe. It's how we do. You know, we're a complete subculture. Like you guys used to be back in about, what, 63 or something? Completely fucking lost, if you ask me. We've still got heart, man. The lost MC are still here. We just don't get on me TV and scream about it. Yeah, sure you are. Whatever you say, Johnny boy. <laughs> Woo! Well now, that's a fine little nest egg to get us through a low point in these here global markets, baby. Sure, Mal. I'm just hoping you, me, and Liz can stay out of jail long enough to enjoy it later on. Yeah, I did, and it handled like a piece of shit. I dumped it in the lockup you mentioned, if you're interested. Not in the van, baby. But maybe I'm interested in what's in the back of it. I'll send Andrea to check it out. See you soon. <laughs>